Okay, we're traveling back in time again for the second episode of the episode, the lost ep the, of the lost episodes. Uh, this is the competition day, and then after that, we're back to current time. So, see you next week. Last week. <laughs> Just arrived at the venue, uh, competition day, last day. I also changed my flight so that I'm actually flying back tomorrow night, tonight rather, rather than tomorrow night. I'm going into that mode where I'm competing and thus I'm really bad at making videos. But I'm gonna show you guys a bit of the venue. I think we kick off in fairly soon. Kitted up, getting those butterflies concrete butterflies in my stomach right now. I think we kick off and have a watch on fairly soon. Um, not that many people in the competition, only about 10, 11, so. <sighs> Feeling it. Catch you guys in a minute. Sorry, got me buzz. Uh, finish the pool now. Won all of them except for one, which I'm annoyed about. I feel like I was just a bit stupid. Um, so it went well, it's going alright. Uh, I never like to kind of be like, yeah, it's going great, but it's going alright. Uh, now onto the D's. There's not many people here, so I, I like I haven't bought my tripod, so I can't film it, but I'm gonna try and set my camera up for one or two of the next matches. Um, and yeah, sorry that there's a real lack of B-roll in here. I hope that you guys are, are kind of not too bored. I'll catch up with you guys in a bit, I need to get back in the zone, listen to music, decompress, all that shit. See you guys. You know I trust you in my home You wanna leave my wife alone I'll be glad when you're dead you rest me Just uh, just finished the round of eight, so now I'm into the top four, which means, uh, yeah, which is good. Um, just uh, fought my friend Vincent, really good match. Uh, managed to come out on top, which is great, 15-1. Uh, um, on to the next round. You ask my wife to wash your clothes, you rascal you. You ask my wife to wash your clothes, it's something else, I suppose. Uh, just won the top four into the top two. Definitely got a medal, which is awesome. Maybe silver, maybe gold. Don't know yet. <laughs> um, sorry that I'm so like monotone and uh, emotionless in these kind of situations because I like to stay as like kind of level-headed as possible until afterwards. If I get too excited or too sad, like it's just not the place I want to be. So. Catch you guys in a bit.
Hello guys. Ah, just finished. Just finished men's four final. Do you want to guess, guess who won? Do you want to pause it now and go to the comments and say if I won or lost? You don't have to do that. Okay. Okay, so if you did that, if you didn't, doesn't matter. I lost. Came silver, came second, the first loser. Do you know what? I'm not even gutted. I had a great time. Um, my first silver medal, apart from my team one, my first individual silver. Finally shook the bronze, the dirty gold curse. Uh, I'd only call bronze dirty gold because there's so many of them. Not in an arrogant way, but as in I could never get silver or gold. Um, so it was a good fight, it was a good fight. And do you know what, it was my first final ever. So that was a really awesome experience. You gotta have a short memory as an athlete. So put that behind me, eat a bit of food. And we got Sabre this afternoon. I don't do Sabre as you guys know, but I just thought as I'm leaving today, I might as well just give it a go. It's on my water bottle, so I can't slap it. Wait, sorry. Definition of no rest for the wicked. Uh, Sabre is now literally five minutes after when I just spoke to you, so kitted up. Every, all the sabers are like, what are you doing? And I'm like, honestly, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how it goes. literally straight to the airport to get a fight. I'm pooped. Just got on the plane, literally like finished, got my medal, straight in the car to the airport. It's like shoved a sandwich in my mouth that I haven't eaten all day. Don't like to eat when I fence. That window over there looks really tiny. Uh, anyway, very emotional day. Lots of highs, mainly highs. One low, gutted about all winning gold. I thought I could really get that gold. But something to work on, I guess. It's uh, probably second is just being the first to lose. Which is annoying, but it's my first individual silver medal, which is awesome, because I got a couple of individual bronze medals before and I got a team silver, but progress, it's good. Uh, something to work on, like I said. I'm knackered, I can't even talk. I'm sorry that this vlog has been so lazy. I, I couldn't film myself, I had no tripod, I asked a couple of people to film me a little bit as well, um, as much as I could, but uh, it was just a difficult one. Um, I hope you guys understand. Uh, it's more of a story time, but Normal service will, 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 will resume as of Monday when I go to Marrakesh. I'm going to take Sunday off because I'm just pooped. See you guys on the other side of that. Goes the medal. I need to show you. I couldn't just do that to you, could I? Maybe I could be like, here it is. And then, uh, and then show you the next episode so you definitely watch the next episode. I'm kidding. I wouldn't do that to you. Here it is. Look at that. I also got a. Uh, I don't know if you can hear me. I also got a foil, an actual like sword, which is great. So uh, I'm gonna give that to my mum because not the kind that I use, and it's not actually one that you can use in competitions. So. Thank you. 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 Thank Turn it in eyes, but we didn't say hello to each other. We're all moving pretty.
the bass she played, bubbling above the coast. Slippery club on the tide. Slip a hard to win. 